hi there welcome back so you have seen some introduction videos and everything right so enough of lectures so so now let's get our hands dirty and dig into the real job right so you can see the weight of the books that i'm holding you know you don't have to study all these to get to make a robot right of course all these books will give you enough knowledge to make it uh, a uh, better understanding of the subjects but right now not needed so i'll come back all right now let's develop uh, an algorithm for a robot for this example i'm going to consider a line following robot okay so first of all you need to be knowing what a line follower robot is so i'll write a scenario in which i'll explain it to you okay so now let's say uh, this is the floor and you have a black colored line on the floor the let's say the dimensions of this line the, uh, the thickness of this line is like 2.5 centimeters okay so our robot will be like here and this is the front part of the robot robot will be traversing in this direction okay so we'll have a, a circuit of lines here okay which will like traverse or uh, like this like that and let's say this is the start point and uh, this is the finish point okay so your robot once you switch it on and leave it it should have the capability to, to traverse from, all the way from start point to the finish point all by itself even if there are some uh, kind of loops in the line circuit or there are some kind of breaks here or something like that so that is what makes it an autonomous line following robot which actually thinks and makes logical decisions whether to go right side whether to go on the left side all by itself so we will be discussing an algorithm based on this example okay so let's do it all right 